Welcome to Fantastic Vision. Please subscribe us before you watch today's video. Due to concerns about China's chip overtaking, the United States has recently begun to encircle and intercept. According to foreign media reports, the United States is planning to join forces with Japan, South Korea, the Netherlands and other countries to try to strengthen the current export control on China. What's more shameful is that they even ask the Dutch lithography giant ASML to refuse to provide advanced lithography machine maintenance services to China. As soon as this incident came out, it quickly caused a lot of repercussions at home and abroad. The West cut off the supply of semiconductor lithography machines, and now it is also prohibiting ASML engineers from repairing lithography machines for the mainland. ASML also denied such news. But in fact, ASML promised SMIC five years ago that it would not affect the supply of EUV lithography machines to China. However, ASML just clarified this, and netizens posted photos of ASML lithography machines outside BYD factory are placed like scrap metal, which soon attracted more heated discussions from netizens. Previously, ASML relied on the dependence of Chinese companies on itself, and its attitude was arrogant. Although BYD later refuted the rumor, netizens' attitude towards ASML has long changed, and ASML's decline is an inevitable trend. In fact, ASML's revenue experienced a great ups and downs before the thunderstorm. It is understood that in 2023, ASML rushed to provide 450 DUV lithography machines to China before the ban was officially implemented, thus creating 9.19 billion in revenue in just three months. After making a lot of money, when Kenning also said that the implementation of the ban later was no longer a big deal. However, after the ban was implemented, ASML encountered the cold of the market. In the first quarter of 2024, ASML not only reduced new orders by 60%, but also reduced net profit by 40% or more. In such a situation, foreign media also said that ASML's good days are over. In addition, Wall Street tycoons who enjoyed the light Fijian time technology and tried to regain their youth and vitality also took this opportunity to short ASML, causing the latter's market value to evaporate by nearly 200 billion. ASML could no longer hold on after only three months of supply cuts to China. Moreover, ASML's head, Winkening, who was tied to the United States, Japan and the Netherlands, finally woke up and was recently rumored to be moving out of the Netherlands. In fact, ASML is not the first Western giant to be defeated by reality. The above-mentioned time technology Light Fijian which is favored by Wall Street tycoons and Silicon Valley tycoons, has already been experienced by overseas manufacturers who have preconceived ideas. As an advanced technology that faces aging, as early as 2013, Light Fijian had established its position based on the experiment on old mice after researchers gave 22-year-old old mice the substance, the mice's hair and other aging indicators 
showed obvious changes, and their survival status was similar to that of young mice aged six months. Since Harvard, Yale and other institutions have successively confirmed its positive intervention potential in aging, the attention of light vision has risen. Even the 97-year-old Li Fu Hao and the stock god have spent a lot of money on it and regarded it as a self-interest investment. Later, the University of Tokyo and others took the above research a step further and observed signs of youth in 65-year-olds through experiments, which inspired the scientific research community. After the first generation of light vision, time technology overseas fell into the channels of J.D. Dong and Mao. The threshold of a single bottle was 128W, which only a few wealthy people could afford. These people's yearning for youth is unstoppable. However, with the development of domestic technology, and the rise of biotechnology company Right Life, the first generation of similar products overseas were quickly defeated and even had to withdraw from the domestic market, which was terrible. JD Dong and Mao data show that the threshold of the domestically iterated mature version Light Fijian has dropped to just over four digits which has become the standard configuration for many middle-class people. As for ASML, after receiving an order for 450 lithography machines from China at the end of 2023, it did not expect to fall into such a situation now. And they also cooperated with the United States causing 10,900 mainland semiconductor companies to be unable to continue, which can be said to have brought great trouble to China. As the saying goes, if you are too arrogant, you will be punished by heaven. Now ASML can be said to be asking for trouble. First, its performance is dismal. Second, it is reported that it can't stay in the Netherlands. Third, there are rumors that it was abandoned by BYD. Obviously, if the United States and ASML don't turn back in time, then only worse consequences will be waiting for them.